totem inoculation, uh, which is where we're going to use logs, you're going to need uh, fresh cut uh, logs of different species, depending on the mushrooms you want to grow. So for the oysters, uh, the recommended species would include poplar, tulip poplar, cottonwood, willow, uh, box elder, and you can also experiment on kind of any of the softer hardwoods that exist out there. Hardwoods meaning trees that le lose their leaves. For lion's mane exclusively, uh, you'd want to grow that on either uh, American beech or uh, sugar maple. And so you would first acquire your trees. You can really cut them pretty much any time of the year between uh, January and, uh, and October. Um, you want to inoculate generally uh, when the temperatures are above 50 degrees. So uh, perhaps May through uh, September would be good times to inoculate. So generally less than three months is what we recommend for the age of the, the cut tree. And that's because the, the wood is still fresh and there's not other fungus that have colonized and taken over the bark. So uh, what we want to focus on are, are fresh woods of those different species, depending on the mushroom you want to grow. So unlike uh, a lot of indoor cultivation or growing mushrooms on straw or coffee grounds, other things, uh, wood is essentially sterile in its natural state. So as long as the log is fresh, the bark, uh, if it's intact, is going to protect the inside of the wood from competitive fungi. So we don't have to do any steaming or boiling or any other treatment, the wood itself is ready to go for mushrooms. The shiitake logs are usually a smaller diameter, four to eight inches, um, because you want to carry them around. But because totems are something you're going to set up and then leave, you can actually go with pretty large diameter wood. Basically anything over 10 inches you can usually stand up on end is really the requirement. But you can go up to you know two feet in diameter um, and inoculate those. In addition to the wood, you'll need uh, mushroom spawn, which is essentially uh, the mycelium of the mushroom. That's the, the white thready stuff that uh, colonizes the, the wood. That can be purchased uh, from a spawn supplier, much like um, seed can be grown, you know, purchased for vegetable production. And uh, we have a list of those producers on our website at cornellmushrooms.org where you can acquire spawn. And a five pound bag is about 15 to 20 dollars and that'll do about 10 of the totem mushroom logs that we're going to show you today. Spawn uh, from purchase, as long as you keep it in the fridge, it should last about six months. Once you open up that bag, uh, you've essentially taken the spawn which has been sterile and you've opened it up to the world. So as soon as you open it up, you want to use it within a month. 